Hey, welcome, and thanks for tuning in to another Sound Painting Saturdays episode coming to you late on a Sunday. Sorry for the delay, and thanks for tuning in. I'm just getting over cold, so please bear with me on this one. But today, I wanted to quickly share with you uh, one gesture and a concept I first learned and was introduced to by my friend Jan, uh, who is visiting from France. Hey, Jan. And Jan and I got together with several other sound painters, and we tried out a few ideas, had a bit of a show-and-tell, a bit of a mini think tank, or a geek tank, as I like to call it, sharing ideas. And one thing he introduced me to, he, one thing he introduced me to was this idea of spotlight. Not just as a lighting design idea, but as a way to really get a foreground and a background. And we explored this and played with it, and since then, this was many months ago. Since then, I've worked with Zaha and refined it a bit and come up with a really powerful but easy and quick way to uh, highlight someone and bring them to the foreground and have the rest of the group become background. So it's simply the prep is a spotlight and then with a point, I will point at that one person or point at someone on camera and that point will immediately trigger whoever is pointed at to take what they're doing and come a bit to the foreground whether that's through raising their status, or that's raising their volume, or adding a bit more complexity. Um, and then it also has communicative meaning to the rest of the group. So the rest of the group, if they aren't included in that point, the rest of the group simplifies their texture, does something that maybe is a bit more static, uh, does something maybe they reduce their volume a bit, um, anything that will feel more like background material and support that person who's a foreground. And it's real quick, it's almost like a uh, on-off, like punching a button and flipping a switch. So again, the prep is this, spotlight, and then, and then if I point at someone else, that immediately changes who is the foreground, whoever I pointed to, and the rest of the group becomes some type of, uh, not really playing a background, but maybe some type of like a background feel, if you can catch that. So anyway, spotlight. Thank you, Jan, and other people who have helped develop that gesture and explore it. We've tried it out as a really quick shortcut. Tell me what you think. Looking forward to your feedback, and I will see you next week.